There's been a lot of news recently about America more than doubling its battery storage in one year. In 12 months alone, battery storage in the United States went from 8.8 .8 gigawatts to around 20. That is an incredible achievement. But not many people have heard about what just happened in Germany, which is maybe just as amazing, or maybe even more so. Hello, my friends. Welcome to the channel. I'm Sam Evans. You're watching the Electric Viking. Great to see you. I'll be able to electrify everything here in Australia. It's basically fully charged from last year, but redone. It's going to be bigger. It's going to be more to see. Tickets are actually going to be cheaper. Well, if you use my promotion code, they'll be cheaper anyway. I'll put a link in the description below. Now, if you do come to the show, guys, you could just go do your thing. But if that's not what you want, then, you know, go see everything. And then if you'd like to, I'm going to do a Q&A session. I'd love to speak to you personally. If you've got any questions, you want to just, um, you know, have a quick chat, say good day. That would be awesome as well. So my promotion code, it's in the description below. There has been a solar and home battery boom in Germany. Now, you kind of think to yourself, well, you know, 90% of the world lives on the sun belt. So 90% of the world lives in an area where we, we call it super, super sunny. They get lots of sun. Solar, solar there makes incredible economic sense. But Germany does not. This is why this is a bit of a surprise. There has been a boom in battery and solar installations in Germany. In fact, Germany now has more solar installed than any other country in Europe. Incredibly, more than 50% of Germany's power now comes from solar. And they've turned off all of their nuclear power plants because they're getting ready for 100% renewables, which is an incredible achievement. However, at a smaller scale, Germans individually are installing solar and batteries at an incredible rate. In 2023, Germany's solar installations doubled. They doubled the total number of units to more than 1 million, reports the solar industry. The new economy says that the batteries have a combined capacity of 12 gigawatt hours, enough to power 2 million, 2 million households in Germany. That's a pretty significant number just at an individual basis. This is not solar farms. This is just individuals. And that was just in 2023 alone. The expansion of solar electricity storage systems has picked up speed rapidly. Both the total number of solar batteries installed and their storage capacity have doubled in only one year. So what this means is that in 2023, the total number doubled, meaning that in one single year, the same amount of solar and home batteries was installed as what was installed over the past 20, 30, 40 years combined. And the reason for this is the price has come down by such staggering amounts that so many German people are saying, you know what, why are we not doing this? Makes sense. Why are we paying for, why are we paying for electricity when we can just install a relatively very, very affordable now home battery and solar system? When installing new solar power systems on private buildings, electricity storage systems are now standard. This is one of the other reasons for such big growth in Germany. New houses basically have to have it. More and more companies are also storing solar power from their roofs to use it around the clock in order to save money, said Germany's director. He added that the market for home and commercial storage systems grew by over 150% in 2023. The industry group lamented that current policies still underestimate the potential of battery storage in Germany and that market barriers continue to slow their speed. Things like politics, things like regulation, red tape. This is what always slows things down in Germany. And now we all know, if you know anything about Tesla, what's been going on with their factory in Germany, they're trying to double the size of it. But all along the entire process, Tesla has had so many problems getting approvals for things, getting things done. Against this backdrop, Storage systems should be considered a central pillar of the electricity system on par with generation, grid and consumption, said the Industry Association. Storage is key in the next phase of the energy transition as Germany aims to cover 80% of power demand with renewable sources in only six years from now. In 2030, they say that they'll hit more than 80%. That's completely believable considering they've already hit more than 50% this year. Now, realistically, one of the challenges with the renewables is that we often have more production than we need. So quite often, it's just too much solar. People install the solar panels, which is amazing, 
but there's nowhere to store all that excess energy. It goes into the grid, it's often wasted. But because so many people are installing batteries, less and less solar is now getting wasted. Experts say that by the end of 2030, they believe probably over 100 million people will be fully isolated from the grid, meaning they don't have to pay for their own energy, they'll have batteries, from their, maybe from their EVs and from solar installed. Now, I believe that number could hit closer to 200, maybe even 300 million. But many experts are saying that is the future. That is the future of the world. It means you won't have to pay for electricity. Again, you have to think to yourself, oh, look at this huge electricity bill. I just got to build $4,000 for electricity. And I looked at that and I thought, oh my goodness, that is enormous. Um, you know, I need to set aside all the money to pay for that. That's something we won't have to think about in the future. Thanks for watching.